Some bottles of water there. Just pick one. Take your bath. When you come, I'll give you what to change it. Okay? Yes. Yes. I was back. Who is she? Oh, okay. The girl. Um, I met her on the road running for her life. From her story, she said some herdsmen attacked their community and killed her parents. So she escaped and ran, ran for her life and I met her on the road. Mm -hmm. mm. What's the hmm 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 all about? Is she staying with us? I have not said so, but for now she has to stay with us. Until I confirm her story tomorrow when I go back to school. How can you bring in a stranger to stay with us? You just heard me a while ago. I said she is not staying with us. She's just staying here for the time being. By tomorrow, I'll confirm her story to know if actually what she told me is true or not. Then we'll now start talking of whether she's going to stay with us or not. I, I don't see how this will become an issue now. Besides, I'm hungry. Get me my food. Okay. I'm here. Oh. Looking beautiful. Thank you, Ben. Ah, that's all right. Hi! Hi, you are here. Um, uh, did Kibo come to see me today? He didn't come today. Good morning. How was your night? Yes, sir. Good morning, ma. Good morning. Mm. Hope you slept well. That's good. Mm. He's happy now. Oh, well, that reminds me. Um, when you go to the market today to get food stuff for us, I want you to get us some clothes so that you can be changing. But I thought you said she's not staying with us. Yes, I said so. But that will still not stop you from getting her clothes. Come 
Ah, that's been nice. Thank you. Huh? All right, so take care of yourself. All right. Huh? I'll be on my way now. Huh? All right. Take care. So where did you say she came from? My sister. My husband brought her home yesterday on his way back from school. And? He said that uh, village people were attacked by ex men and her family members were killed. So, do you plan keeping her? That is the same question I asked my husband. But you know how logical he is? He said he will give me an answer when he returned back from school today, after his investigation. Okay, till then. But you have to go and dress up. Let's go and meet the herbalist. Agnes, are you sure his herbs will help me conceive? Eliza, you ask too many questions. Being in marriage for six years, six good years, without a child, is not normal. You have to be ready. To do anything to have a child for your husband. I heard the herbalists give medicine to barren women, and I even know some of them who have conceived. Are you sure? Mm -hmm. Have faith, my friend. Have faith. Then let me go inside and dress up. Mm -hmm. Please hurry up. Don't talk about the fight. I give I trust you. Don't talk about the fight. 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 Don't talk about Nne, since you are new in this village. Yes. My name is Ngozi. And my name is Ujumwa. So what's your name? My name is Mamaka. My village was attacked and my parents were killed. So Tita Timothy saved me and brought me to this village. I'm so sorry about that. But how come you came down here alone to fetch this water? Mm. I'm sure his wicked wife Elizabeth sent you. Yes. <laughs> No, she didn't send me. She gave me some clothes to wash. So along the line, water at some got finished. And I asked my way down here to go to get water and go finish the washing. Yeah, that's so kind of you. But sorry for your loss. Don't worry. From now, we are now your new friend. Okay. Yes, we are now your new friend. We can come to Viva. We can come to stream to play anytime we like. And Papa wants to stop for me. Thank you. Yeah. Wow. Hope you're enjoying our village. Yes, <laughs> very well. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
How are you today? Ah, good. Who gave you all these clothes? Uh, Auntie brought all of them and asked me to wash it. You mean you've been washing clothes since morning? Yes, yes, sir. Yes, so where where is she now? She went out with a woman. Have you eaten? No, sir. I'm not eating since morning. Since morning? Yes. Now, stop whatever you're doing now. Just go inside, take it to borrow here. Cook it and eat to your satisfaction. Okay, sir. Right. Thank you, sir. Hope you can cook very well. Yes, sir. Go and cook. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, sir, what to eat? Uh, no, forget about me. I'll be fine. Let me rush off and see a friend. Take my book. Huh? Thanks, sir. Okay, I'll Welcome. Good day. Who gave you my food to eat? Brother came. Brother came. Have you finished washing the clothes? He has not washed his own clothes. He has it. He has it. Not to wash the clothes. I'll take those food inside the kitchen. Oh yeah. Eat my food in my house. Come back here. Was the one that asked her to finish washing the clothes. But you know she's still too young to wash my clothes. And so? <laughs> meaning what? Okay, you ask her to wash these clothes. Since morning she has not eaten. Is that proper? Are you questioning me in presence of her? Come in silence, talk. Is it not you? I will deal with you. I saw everything myself. Everybody in the community was killed. They were all wiped out. The killings was massive. And this government has to stand up to their responsibilities. They have to do something about this. Huh? How can they just sit back and all these herdsmen and unknown government are just, you know, killing people, destroying properties without anybody reacting to it? They're just keeping mood. It's not proper. And it's just a small village that is like, it's just like a farm settlement. Every living soul was wiped out. What a pity. Mm -hmm. this, this, this government has to do something. They have to wake up from their slumber. They have to wake up. Before things get out of hand. What about Wamaka's parent? I don't even understand what I'm saying. No single relative of hers, including her parents, were left alive. Everybody <laughs> was killed. And so? As you can see, we have no choice. She has to stay with us. Maybe by next time, I can enroll her in one school so that she can start going to school. 
Let's give her a better life. Mm. Okay. Okay. Oh, hi, my husband. That reminds me. I went with my friend to see the herbalist and was told he died last night. Okay. I know. Listen. I've told you these times with her. Let's be patient with God. Let's be patient with God. We've both gone to the hospital and it was proven that we are okay medically. So what do we do? Let's just live our faith with God. But it's six years already. Six years. I know, I know. I know. No time is late for God. At his appointed time, he will visit us. Let's just be patient with him. Okay. 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 No okay. So, can I eat now? All right. Let me get you. Fine, Oma. Why did you say that? Ha 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 ha! My sweet love. Wow. Every time I look at you, I feel like germinating. <laughs> That's my woman. Amaka, how are you? I'm fine. Amaka, what's this? It's not that weak, that wicked dancing. Teacher's wife. That woman is very, very wicked. Don't worry, all is well. I'm only supporting her. But why don't you want to report her? In fact, if she beats you next time, you can't tell her husband. If you can't tell her husband, come and tell us. We'll fight for you. Okay, okay. Don't worry. Okay, now let's go to this room. Okay. I show you okay. Yes. Be fine. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Meet me in this house. I'm waiting for her.
Come. As I come here. Where are you coming from? My friend, so she is staying with you now. My husband says to not Elizabeth. How true is that her story? She may be the one who killed her family members, you know. That is her business. I can't be so free for two things now. I'm childless and she can never be my second problem. Mm -hmm. Have you heard from the Dibia? Mm. My mother said the Dibia traveled to Umudim. Don't worry. As a friend, I will do anything possible. To make sure you have a child for your husband. <laughs> Agnes, you are truly a friend. What are friends for? <laughs> Come on, get out from there, idiot! Thank you. That's because you're dead, mother! See your stupid girl, no fear. No sense. Calm down, Elizabeth. Calm down. Don't she tell me calm down, that girl. These days. <laughs> that one, children. Well, that girl is a big witch. Big one. Calm down. Don't let her come between you and your husband. Eh? <laughs> me. I will break her. This is just the beginning. She will see the real Elizabeth. Nobody will ask her to run away. Good day, sir. Yeah, how are you? You're fine, sir. Sir, so please, would like to know if Mamaka is fine. Mamaka? How do you know her? Oh, she's your friend, right? Right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> she's fine. She's fine. Okay, sir. Sir, please, would like to, I would like to tell you a thing you want to stop beating her. Enter we see her. She's always crying. Oh. She's always sad whenever we see her. Really? Yes, <sighs> Okay, no problem. I'll, I'll handle it. Okay. Sir, please, when you get to me, tell her face, ask after her. Yes, tell her John and Gazi ask after her. Of course, she will hear. Okay. Huh? Thank you, sir. We'll be on our own. Thank Bye -bye. you. Thank Bye -bye, you. Bye bye, sir. Yeah. on that child again. What's wrong with you? Even the villagers have noticed the way you've been beating this girl. Whenever a child misbehaves, she has to be corrected. Not in this manner. Not in this manner. You'll be cruel to her. Come to think of it, why do you always feel bad whenever I correct that girl? Or do both of you have something in common that I don't know? Me? Do I know? A girl of her age? How will I know? Are you now seeing me as such an irresponsible man? No, is that how you now see me? Don't allow me to come back in peace and leave me alone, huh? Eh? Make her new. See, don't disturb me with your noise in this house again. What's that? That next thing. Sir. Mama, come on in. How are you? Fine, sir. How was your night? Yes, okay. Um, I have a good news for you. What is it, sir? Um, by next time, you'll be starting school. 
<laughs> so, thank you, sir. Okay. Thank you, sir. It's May okay. the gods bless you. No problem. It's not um, so, it simply means that you'll be going to school with me every morning. <laughs> so, happy. so, you're happy, right? Yes. Good. Um, get done with what you're doing before your auntie wakes up. Thank you, sir. Hmm? Yes, sir. Take care of yourself. Thank you, sir. Okay. So, see you. Okay, sir. Bye bye, sir. Bye. Bye, Mr. Welcome back. I will. I will. <laughs> So you're looking at me today. What's the good news? Guess what? What? Hmm? My uncle has promised that I'll be going back to school as from next ten. Wow. Are you serious? This is yes. good news. Hard. That man is very good. May she yes. bless him. Yes. But how do you even manage to get married to that witch? That man doesn't deserve that witch as a wife. The woman that oh. cannot give him a child for almost six years of their marriage now. My sister, I'm telling you, it's just not complete without a child. Let's forget about her. Um, let me fetch what and go back home before she starts beating me as usual, well, you know. Sure. Let's help you fetch Let's help you. Thank you. Thank you. Come down. Ah, so next time I'll be going to school. Yes. I'm going to see you. I'm going to see you. I'm going to see you. I'm going How many minutes will it take you to fetch your dad? One. One. I said, come here! Kneel down. Kneel down! This one. Kneel down. Kneel down. How many minutes? Kneel down. You're making me to talk in this house. Okay? I need to It's a wicked woman. Useless man! You think you are a man! Useless man! 
girl like you, six years, good six years, you cannot get me pregnant, and you call yourself a man, an important man like you. Me important? Yeah! Hey, 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 you see, you, you want to slap me, see, your guest stop you not to slap me, and you call yourself a man, come and beat me, Timothy, come and beat me, you're not talking again, you should be ashamed of yourself, come and beat your mate. Your husband wanted to beat you yesterday because of that useless girl. My sister, I knew that girl would bring a problem to my marriage. <laughs> you have to send her away or she will take your husband away from you. Uh -uh. That girl is still a small girl. She can't do that. Children of these days are unpredictable. She can't, no. Uh -uh. She cannot. Come to think of it, Eliza. You have been married for six years now mm. without a child. Mm -hmm. Do you not think that the fault is coming from your husband? My sister, I taught as much, but we visited the hospital in Urago, and the doctor said we are both okay. Mm -hmm. These hospitals and their doctors, they can make mistakes too sometimes. Agnes. Agnes. Uh -huh. ah. Don't worry. I have a plan. What is the plan?
we are going to start from what I taught you yesterday. Okay. So, uh, which of them can you remember? Okay. Give her her back. Give him him back and give them them back. <laughs> no, it's not give her her back, give him him back and give them them back. No, it's give her her back, give him his back and give them their bags. So say it again. Give her her back, give him him back and give them them back. Yes, the same, the same thing. All right, let's leave that. Um, <clears throat> let's go, let's translate uh, figures. One, two, three, four, then in Igbo. Okay. All right. One, ofu. One, ofu. No, no, not one. Not one, ofu. One, ofu. Two, abwa. Three, ato. Four, ano. One, ofu. One, ofu. Oh. Mama, it's not woman. Man is woman. This one is one. 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 Ufu. Say. One ufu. One ufu. One ufu. Uh huh. Hmm? Pronounce it again. One. Not one. 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 Okay, let's ebonize it now. One. 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 Oh. Ah, not that my stupid husband that lasts for only 20 minutes. I'm a woman. Yes. Good day, Kenneth. Hey, Kenneth. I'll be on my What is it? No. I just come to check if your sister, Jama, is around. Your mother sent for her. She's not around. You can go. Yeah. Okay. What is the meaning of that song? Not to know. Thank <laughs> you. 
how was it? And Kenil was so sweet on bed. And I enjoyed it. <laughs> I told you. Let me see how you will not get pregnant by month end. We are planning on seeing this evening to drink out and also tomorrow morning to make love. But his mother is always at home. I don't know where we'll stay. You don't know where you will see. Eliza, bring him to your house now. Oh, goodness. What? My husband will find out. Are you going to tell him? Once your husband leaves for school, invite him over. You both will enjoy yourself for one hour. What about that witch? One marker. Hi. Eliza, are you Elena? Send that one on an errand and enjoy yourself. Oh, don't you want to get pregnant again? Agnes, <laughs> you are a good friend. You're right. By the way, there is one marker. You know I don't like seeing her. Her sight irritates me. So I sent her to the stream to fetch me some water. Mm-hmm. Ah, you are talking. Yeah? This road in the nona. Go and get me something to eat now. I will get you anything. You are a friend. Please. Please. Yeah. <laughs> Go and get me. Agnes, Agnes, one man. Listen, hold your greeting. Agnes, listen to me and listen good. Listen to me. I don't want your association with my wife. I want it to end this minute. You have been a very bad influence to my wife. I, what beats my imagination and expectation is how can a woman who is over 30, is not, she's not married and she's a friend to a married woman. What kind of advice can you give to my wife? Huh? What kind of advice, Agnes? They call you Agnes, one more, Agnes, one more. You know, there's a worry everywhere. Listen to me. Any day I set my eyes on you in my house, I'm going to cut your two legs off. Don't just tell me. Any day you come to my house again from now henceforth, I will cut off your legs. And I'll put Agnes on my name, put it. You will see me. You will see my color. And may your chi and the gods of this land destroy you for destroying my marriage. But Mr. Timothy, I... You I, did what? You destroyed my marriage. You are influencing my wife badly. You are a bad influence. You've just heard me. Stay away from my wife. Stay away from my wife, Agnes. One man. Zawari Jenaga. Boats in this river, and you can see. I'm giving you guarantee. Hmm? You guys should just pay me and. Hmm? Okay, it's not as if I don't trust you, but look at this place now. This book is setting now. My see that. Just trust me on this boat. Just that I have small problem. You know, anything can happen. Okay, so me. I just need money. That's why I want to sell this boat. But I want you to know that this is the best boat that you can ever float in this river. Can okay, please don't fail us? You need this in our money, matter. So if come and see what pay money for you. Come and see what I'm doing. Let us let us pay money for the event. Even because let us check this place. That yes. is what I'm doing. Yeah, I will check everything you know, before I will talk Trust about me. price. Because yes. I will not make any mistake to pay my money for nothing. You will use this boat, eh? And you will remain it for your own. 
and don't want one. Let it happen as you talk, uh -huh. because I will be happy for that. So you guys can just pay me. Maybe we should pay you. Are we going to resolve that? But the way I'm seeing this, but are we not going to check other ones here? Because. I trust again. I trust again. Eh? Are you sure? I trust. I ask you again. Are you sure? I trust you again. Don't no worry now. Let's, let's go on. That must be the case. Worry. The guy is very good. I'll be too late. Trust him. What's the meaning of this? Why are you staggering like this? My husband, my husband. Hmm. How is school today? We're, we're even drunk. <laughs> What's the meaning of this? A young lady like you? Going out with a young boy and get drunk like this. Look at you. You are irresponsible. Yes. I took seven bottles of beer and I feel good. You're not, and you are not ashamed of yourself. No. You see? A wife of a teacher that should be a role model to others. You're getting drunk. Look at it by this time of the day. Timothy. You like talking. May I feel good? You can sleep. Ah, please. You are tired. Look at it. You are in I feel good. <laughs> What is, what is all this? Huh? A woman that should be a role model to others, look at her disgracing herself. I know what I saw. I saw Ikine, son of Mazi Okafo, sleeping with your auntie. Elizabeth. Uju. Are you sure of what you're saying? Mm-hmm. Enough time has been given to her to change and welcome her new gifts. But she doesn't want to learn. Soon she will understand. Hmm. Huh. Mama. I don't understand. What are you trying to say? <laughs> don't worry. Soon you'll understand. Come on, let's go and play. I understand this stranger. They are beginning to scare us. This may be the last time we we'll play like this together again. Let's enjoy this minute because it may not come again. Mm. And you both are nice. Your chief and your several will bless you both with your desires. <sighs> what is life? Let's go to the river and swim. Mm. Mama Ka. Mm. I don't understand you again. Huh. Anyway, you say she can sing. Yes. Let's go. Sing. Oh, mm -hmm. let's go. Your husband gave me the insult of my life. Is that why you stopped visiting? Yes, now. He even warned me to stop coming to his house. As what? That house belongs to both of us. It cannot do anything. Come on, let's go, Joe. 
<laughs> no, Elisa. Don't worry. I insist. Let's go. He can't do anything. That one. I, I, I'm the one talking to you now. Let's go. Okay. If you insist. If he's man enough, let him come and do his worst. Come on, let's go. Are you afraid of that stupid man? Afraid of that man? That useless man? I told you I'm in charge. I'm friend. He can't do anything. Hey! man is in charge of our home. Yes, so. Hi! I don't give him that space to talk to me anymore. Hey, when sure. I make decisions in this house, it's fine. Bam. Yes. Bam. Uh -huh. That is how a home should be. <laughs> Hi, good friend. Yes, Hi. sir. Can we do this coming Can Oni we ring as you be, O Gamuta Abo, Moburu Nane. Welcome, my husband. Mr. Timothy. No. I told you. <laughs> you are in charge. Yes. yes so. Hi. Any decision I make, it's final in this house. Yes. yes. I'm not doing it. Ah! No, 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 come back here. Come back. Come back. Come back. Come back. Come back. Let me see you. Let me see you in this compound again. Come in here again with your two left leg and see what I'll do to you. See, Marty. What is the meaning of all this? How many times have I warned her not to come to this compound? How many times? As who? Are you the owner of the house? The house belongs to both of us. So why will you chase my friend? I am the man of the house. So I have every right to say who comes here or not. Huh? Timothy, hmm. from today as forth, I will not give you food in this house again since you have decided to chase my friend away. Oh, you will not give me food? Yes! Elizabeth, they call you Elizabeth. You think you are now the Elizabeth Queen of England? Huh? Even Elizabeth is in Nigeria. You are Nigeria Elizabeth. Let me tell you for your information. Since Mwa Amaka came into this house, she has been the one cooking my food and serving me. Yes. And even that was even when I came to realize that what you have been feeding me all this while has been poisoned. And it has broken all the lining in my stomach. Me. You are Elizabeth! Poison. Mm -hmm. Nigeria Elizabeth, you. You've been feeding me poison in this house. So tell that your friend. Agnes Wamma, that's what it is. That any time I see her here, I'm going to cut her two legs off. You won't. Timothy, I'm feeding you with poison. Wamaka is giving you good food. No problem. No problem. When I said that girl would bring problem to my marriage, it's very obvious. <laughs> I don't know that. Elizabeth, poison. Poison is your second name. You don't know. Hey, hey. Don't worry, oh. She you say one maker is giving you food. You will not eat in this house. Let me see how she will cook in my kitchen and serve you. Sis Elizabeth feed you with poison. I don't blame both of you. It's not your fault. Ah! I made a mistake. Getting married to a useless man like you. Me! Giving you poison. Go to the forest, go and get firewood. 
But but until we still have some left in the kitchen. Come to the forest and get firewood. Nonsense. It's going so stupid. Girl. Soon everything will end. What matter? What did you just say? We are not made. <laughs> you come to this house to meet me. Since you can challenge me, you'll be ready to fight me. Nonsense. Let me check if my kid is coming. You have been waiting for you, sis. Oh, my God. Come, oh, cool. let's go. <laughs> I've made a vow to myself that I will never lay my hands on you. You will beat me today. Huh? Well, you beat me. Uh, you, you think you can cover, cover, cover up? You can't cover up. You beat me today. Uh, uh, Elizabeth, Elizabeth, let me call you the way you your mother used to call you. Elizabeth! Elizabeth, daughter of Kweke, see what she did to yourself. How dare you! Beautiful mother of the sea, the great queen mother, the one that gives help to those who cry to her for help, the one that gives children to the barren. I greet you. Your daughter Elizabeth is here. She cries to you for help. She has been married for the past six years without a child. Please, Queen Mother, great one, give her a child.
She has had your prayer, but she promises to come to you. She will come to you. She says whatever you give to her, she will give to you. If you give her peace, she will give you children. But if you give her problem, she will double your trouble. Be warned. For treating me bad, bad. You, you will never, never hear, hear the cry, the cry of, of a child. child. You shall, you shall remain, remain barren, barren to the day, day you die. die. And an official car for you, sir. Hey! 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 Official car. Accommodation. Free. <laughs> you see? You see? My tea has remembered me. My tea has remembered me. Official car in the city. Hey, hey. You see? <laughs> so, my only creature, <laughs> you have to rest now. <laughs> Congratulations, sir. You are expected to be in the school next week, sir. Okay. Thank you very much. Okay, okay, okay. Thank you, young man. <laughs> you see? You see? Huh? Hi! Timothy made the wrong choice in your wife. Pray to your chief to give your own wife. By this time tomorrow, you will smile again. Very hey, hey. This is, I mean, it's now they know my words. I don't deserve to be in this kind of village. I'm supposed to be in the city. <laughs> with official car, official house and everything. Yes! At least, a teacher of my caliber with my sophisticated intellectualism, vocabulary, articulations and adjectival descriptions. I ought not to be here. Yes! Yes! 
Because when I came here exhibiting my, my sophisticated intellectualism in the city, people will know that, yes, my grammatical articulation can destroy their mendula umplugata and, oh, yes, we must go to the city. They go hear grammar. Thank you.